As part of his campaign, Doug often photographs dogs that have been rescued from shelters. Today, Julie Conway has brought in her pit bull, Porter. Actually, Who's that guy? This is Porter. Porter's, as you can see, a little nervous. He doesn't even want to look over here. Hey. Porter, come and take a picture. Oh. oh Sometimes. Look at, tail wag. look at that. He's like, all right, well, jeez. Sometimes it now. takes a friend to help another one. Stay right there, Junior. Porter is coming up. Hey. Maybe there you can go. use Junior as a, as a first example, and then, oh, actually, that'd stay. be a really awesome shot of the two of them. Yeah, that's a good shot right there. Buddies, stay. Yeah. There we go. They're lacking hearts, not jaws. Yes. <laughs> and for the future, instead of doing this petting thing, it's best to do the uh, deep tissue massage because that's what relaxes the brain. Okay. So if the brain is tense, you just tell them stay there. But this one forces the brain to relax. Okay. There you go. Good boy. Oh, wow. See? So the same frame of mind you had in the bottom, yeah. now you had it in the top. Unbelievable. Yes. Right. Yeah. Stay. Awesome. Awesome, Porter. Great, Porter. Look at that. Perfect. Great. So what's the story on Porter? Well, I took in Porter in uh, May of last year. Both of his hind legs were broken. He had broken ribs, fractured skull, broken jaw. He was a real mess. Some human had done that to Porter. Some, yep. Yeah, somebody had witnessed someone beating him up, even though he had been through so much abuse. I mean, he's just a love. Porter's a really perfect example of what I'm trying to do with this portrait series because he's an example of a dog that was found beaten, kicked, broken. Yeah, but he was trying to lick everyone through his broken jaw. He was trying to wag his broken tail. I mean, he's just, he's a great ambassador for the breed. Douglas Saunders was inspired to create his Not a Bully portrait series after he encountered prejudice against his own pit bull from friends and neighbors. So you got Emma from the shelter? Yeah. Yes. And uh, you bring her to your home. What was the reaction with the neighbors? Uh, it's funny because most buildings, if you have a dog, they're like, absolutely not pit bulls. No. So finding a building to live in uh, with a pit is actually very difficult. So legislation's where it starts, and education. So that's the whole story. Not a, they're not a bully. That's the ultimate. It's a good campaign. 